Hi, welcome to my channel. I have a uh, journal that I'd like to share. Uh, this is um, a manila envelope, 10 by 13 uh, envelope that I've covered with some um, fabric and um, cardstock. And it's pretty tall. I can hardly get it in the frame here. It's, um, yeah, 10 inches. And then it's uh, six inches across this way. I have some cute little buttons here on the strings in the middle of the signature. And this is a thank you gift. Um, Maria, if you don't want to see it, turn off your uh, don't watch this. So it has some uh, buttons here. And I'll be making three other. Uh, this is a Mary Inglebright uh, junk journal or journal. So it's pretty tall. I can't get it quite in frame. And I got a new light here, one of these ring lights. So hopefully uh, I have better lighting. And I added this little pretty red gingham trim here. And I had this elastic band. I sewed these buttons on here. And then here's some cherries, the charms. That was cute. So it's one signature sewn in. And this is this pretty paper. I got this from Pamela. Gypsy Girl Crafts by Pamela. Uh, we had traded some... Mary Bright items, and I did use it for this book. It's really cute. And then we open it up, and it has this pocket here. It's a fabric pocket, and I added Rick Rack here. And there's also like this is in the paper. This Rick Rack here, and it says life is just a bowl of cherries. But Mary Anglebright says life is just a chair of bowlies. <laughs> and um, here I have a little uh, card here for journaling. Added this um, ribbon and this little cherry here. It's cute. So we have that. And so there's space to write. Here I have a pocket and I use a, a die cut to cut this out and it has a little tea bag and it has a, a little paper doily right there this pocket and they have this little card that says do unto others as you would have them do unto you and the little girls are having a tea party good journal on the back here I uh, put this little um, card there and it has on a bag and you open it up and to the side and have a little tea, bit, tea bag. So it just goes back in there. It's cute. It says here. And there's the heart. So they're having that tea party, so that's why I added that little heart there. And we have some pretty striped paper. Room to write here and that line paper, and here's the Mary Anglebright paper with her traditional flowers and black and white. And, um, and then here I glued on extra paper here because I wanted to add up this. And here's some of her drawings. Added these little stickers, some ledger paper added this it's good to be queen and she's on her throne there and then here um, I added this it's an envelope and this holds this in place and then on the other side the envelope is held in place right here so there's the pretty envelope and then I added some stripe paper for journaling and that goes tucks back here. And then back 
into this little oops there. and this is from a Mary Englebright book on how to make things I think this was telling how to do these shutters here the window treatments and then I added um, some cutoffs here we could journal here and here's a packet it says books fall open and you fall in and this is for Maria and she's an author so I thought this was appropriate talking about books and these were some cutoffs that I thought would be cute um, to write little notes in and we have this one Here is, yeah, this was a part of a wallpaper. This is friend. And then I made this little Franken envelope stamped and um, just put um, different elements here. And then you open it up and then you have paper to journal. And that goes back there. And a cute little Scotty die. And some more bright paper. I added a bingo card to this pocket here. And here's a playing card. It says, Home is where the heart is. There's a little playing card there. And um, I added this little fabric heart that I got from Pamela. Now, this paper's been glued on here to the side to give more room for journaling. And here's this cute little image of this little girl reading. Too cute. And one of her sayings, bloom where you're planted. And I have these cute little girls in this pocket. And you could put a picture on the back of that. And then this also opens up for journaling. And you can just paper clip that close. More room for journaling. And I did this little uh, fabric cluster here pretty materials. I'm going to add it, uh, this to the edge. And here you have an envelope that you get at things to. It has little cherries on there and some more pretty paper that you could write. And here's some more of that Mary Inglebright paper. With the bowls of cherries. And a little memo page. Here, this is um, writing paper, but what I did was, here's the writing paper and I added this paper to it, and I folded this over, so this comes off for journaling, here, and then all this also opens up. Uh, I've never done that before or seen it before but I'm sure it's probably around but I just did that thought that was fun here's some stripe paper and this is that's what friends are for a little card for journaling a lot of writing space here and added this little heart card and this is a coloring page this is the middle of the signature. It says, neglect not the gift that is in thee. And here's all the fun little buttons. A little heart journaling. So this could be colored in. And there's more space for journaling. And then here, I thought this was cute. I fussy cut this little pencil cup. These little girls are cute. And then I added a little card here that could be written in. So we have that, and then this paper clips on. So this comes off, and then this opens up like so for writing. And then this has been glued on here. So this goes back like that, and this, and then you have, this opens up for writing, 
And that goes on there. I thought that was pretty cute. I want to do this more often. I like that element. And then here's your, the other side to it. And this paper's going to glue it onto here. And there's a little chair and a little kitten sticker. Added this to the side. And there's some of that paper. The writing space. This is part of the wallpaper border. Ah, uh, how good it feels. The hand of an old friend, Longfellow. Space to journal. And then I glued this on here. And we have some pretty papers here. This is part of the Mary Englebright window treatment page. Whimsy shutters. Here we have a journal card this week in review. Here's some here. And it flips over. And then I fussy cut these books out. And I added this little booklet that says The Queen Has Spoken. And then those stickers. And then we have papers to write on. And like I said, I will be doing about three more of these Mary Angle Brights. This one is spoken for. Gift to Maria. She um, graciously gave me a lot of little golden books and some stamps and all kinds of stuff. So I really appreciate that, Maria. So sweet of you. And then this is from the other side. I added that. So this is also a tuck. Celebrate good times. Here's some cherry paper for writing. And then I added this little cute tag. And here's a card. Mary Engelbright card. Here's a little journal card. I added this to the side here. And also this little tag. And here's another one, a cute card. There was a definite process in which one made people into friends. It involved ta talking to them and listening to them. For hours at a time, Rebecca West. So you could journal on that. And I glue this paper here out of these little stickers. And I hope you can see all the book here. Out of this edging and cute little chair and teapot. You know, did I forget something? No, I think I. Why do I think I missed something here? Did I show this? There was a tea bag in here. I can't remember if I showed it or not. Anyway, there's a tea bag in there. All of a sudden I couldn't remember. So if I did already show it, sorry about that. Okay, so where were we? Here, we have some ledger paper. This is a little fabric cluster from Pamela. And a pretty colorful Mary Englebright paper. And the writing space. It's just a bright, cheerful book. Here is um, a couple little cards. Look how cute they are. I'm going to go in here, and then I have this little stopper here to um, keep them from falling out, and then this also opens up for drawing. And then here's the last, and I have this little booklet that I made with papers here. I have them sewn in. And then here's a little bag. And I have a couple cutoffs for writing and so 
some more paper. goes back in here and then this has a magnet and it opens up and you can just put a bag in here but you could add more things in here and that magnet just shuts that and so that's the back with this cute time for tea miss smarty put your heart in it too cute home is what a heart is really fun book to make so hope you like it, Maria. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.